back to title contention and a heavyweight championship opportunity for this man, but he has put in all the right work, and a lot of people give him a great chance to get the job done tonight. You know, when you've been there and you get back here, it's not new. There are a lot of things that are familiar, but how do you change the result? How do you assure that in this time, during this chance, you ultimately walk away with the championship? He's been here before, John. The team's been here before. They are confident that this time they get it done. And that self-belief is rooted in the preparation, right? He's got speed, he's got power, all the tools to rest the belt away. We'll see if we have a new UFC heavyweight champion by Nantel. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. All right, so here's the Korean Superboy, Duho Choi. Another fight here tonight. His first two UFC wins took less than two minutes combined. The majority of Duho Choi's wins have come by first round knockout. We'll see if he can rack up another one here tonight. Just misses with that one. Beautiful straight right hand. Landed the overhead. Another big shot to the head. It won't take many of those. Oh, a nice little right hook there. Wheel kick lands. Oh, good vision defensively. Let's get that oh, you land, I land. Is that what we're doing here? Oh, and so now he lands another combination, so it's never just one shot. There's always two or three coming behind. A lot of times people throw singular strikes. Not this gentleman. This man is stringing four, five, six in a row. What a great job. There's that jab. Use that well, he is a tactician. He does not discriminate when it comes to his weapons. There's a sidekick. That sidekick can go to the legs or to the body. What a technique. Big shot to the head. Two minutes have expired in our opening round. Oh, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Right over the top, right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that one. So pretty good recovery by the opponent after getting stunned pretty good. Got to capitalize on those opportunities. I mean, you can't waste these opportunities. You don't get them as often as you'd like. So when you get a guy hurt, you got to find a way to finish the fight. All right, so the overhand has certainly been a big weapon for him here tonight. Look for him to go right back to it here if he can find an opening. Outstanding knee to the body there. He's the taller fighter. And might as well put that size to good use, and he certainly did so there. Keep that pressure high now. Two minutes remain in the round. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Beautiful punch to the body. Just out of range with that right hand. Oh, that one landed, yep. Well, he's certainly keeping busy, DC, connecting with most of the punches he's thrown. I mean, punches and punches. He's doing a great job. Bleeding now. Nasty cut on his nose. Oh, nice land with the knee. You see the taller fighter having no issue getting the limb to the target there. Cannot take those leg kicks clean like that. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Under a minute now to go. 
straight punch. Useful. All right, so some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. Is that a huge strike right there? I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Nice leg kick. Under 20 seconds now to go. Blood is flowing now. I know a lot of you like that, but he has got to figure some things out defensively or this fight's going to end. He's got to move his head, John. But the problem is, now he's got the blood to deal with. He's got a sharp striker in front of him. He has got a lot of things to deal with if he wants to win this fight. But right now, the focus needs to be on the head movement so you're not getting hit in that cut. All right, so there's the end of the round. Big story in this one now. The cut on the bridge of that nose from that strike. The cut man is in there. Should be able to shut this one and potentially prevent it from being a factor here moving forward. All right, 60 seconds between rounds. That gives us a chance to look at some of the replays from that previous round, including some of the damage sustained on his nose. Yeah, it was a, it was a nice shot that landed that opened up that cut on the nose. Granted, any cut is... Bad. But this one is in a spot where it shouldn't affect him too much. What we have to watch, though, John, is if the nose is broken. Right. Then it's hard for him to breathe. Yeah, get the blood in that nasal cavity, potentially trickles down the throat a little bit. I mean, fighting just sounds like a really fun <laughs> career. Well, let's get to the next round. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter of eight. Keep your distance. Keep your distance now. He does a great job of getting that leg kick to the target. Oh, and he lands another combination here, really starting to get into a striking group. I mean, it's stringing them together so effectively, never throwing the same attack more than once. What a job to recognize all the openings in his opponent's defenses. Oh, nice land there with the punch. You see, he's taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. Nice crack there. Strong roundhouse kick there. Going to the body now with that hook shot. Nicely done by the Korean Super Bowl. Right hand over the top. He's going to get himself knocked out. He got to take a moment. He's going to get knocked out if he doesn't take a break. And that one certainly found the target. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. And a miss with the right hook. Fast jab, lands. High kick landed for him there. Just over three minutes now to go in round two. On, Let's go. Choi's got a pretty deep bruise now starting to appear on the right side of his body. His opponent has done a lot of work in that region tonight. Good jab there by the champion. Oh, nice jab. Great job getting that punch to the target. Well, you thought the cut man did his job, but that cut on the nose is just nasty, and it is pouring blood now. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by the Korean Super Bowl. Got the hook in quickly. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Under two minutes now in round two. Nice job, defensively. Oh, how about that strike over the top, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Beautiful level change. Make him think you're going low and then come right over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. Well, 
Well, why fix what's not broken? Why not go right back to that overhand here again? Just missed with the left there. Hands high, hands high. Oh, doing work with the jab. Man, that cut is only getting worse. Canvas cleanup guy's gonna be busy. Man, DC, his hands look good. A lot of volume, a lot of accuracy tonight. He's doing a great job being accurate, but he's also very fast. Look at the hand speed, right? Oh, nice. Well, it's been a wild fight thus far. Perhaps a contender for some bonus money at fight's end. These guys are going to have to dig deep. They're both hurt. They're both hurt. You expected it, though. You expected a close fight. You did not expect a war like this, though, where both guys, from the moment they said fight, went forward, got in each other's face, and just beat each other up. It's been tremendous. 20 seconds to go round two. Tries the flying knee to no avail. Nice body kick there. Final seconds here of round two. Offering up over the top. This fight's gonna be over. Himself. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the court. He mixed it up. He went high. Oh. Going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. All right, back to the stools we go, and that is a really severe cut, so we will monitor him between rounds as they furiously get the cut man in there. Don't be stupid. All right, well, I'm no doctor. I'm not going to diagnose a broken nose, but a huge cut on the bridge, and his opponent continues to attack it. Continues to attack it as he should. He did the damage. He was the one that landed the shot that opened up that cut. Now he's got to make his opponent pay for it. He was a bit lax in the defense, and now... He's got that massive cut on the bridge of his nose. You ready to fight? Ready. Start. Here we go, third round of this championship. Fight. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Well, he blocked that punch. Choi circling towards the left side now. Very fast jab lands for him. That was a beautiful head kick. That's a great kick landed there. Oh, doubling up now, tripling up on that knee. Man, his body not looking too good right now. It's not quite Dominic Reyes against Jan Bojovic, but these body strikes really starting to add up. They're starting to pay dividends. You know, he spoke to us about this earlier in the week, how he was going to eat this guy up from bottom to top. He was going to go in reverse. That is exactly what he has done. Oh, and there's a kick now to the body. That one blocked by Short. Whiffs on that offering. Well, you really hope that damage like this doesn't stay with him throughout his mixed martial arts career, but I'd be okay with not seeing him take another head strike at this point. No, it's over. You could tell that the fight is done. It's on the ringside position or the corner to take a closer look and stop this fight. Under three minutes now to go in round three. Well, we talked about that reach advantage. Is he still oh. He's got him hurt. He's got to start looking to finish. Well, it seems like there has been an opening for that overhand all night long. Let's see if he goes back to it here. Oh, right oh, big, big shots here. Gets 
gets the win by TKO. Oh, my goodness. Just a relentless effort out of this fighter here tonight. The ref had no choice but to step in, and that is how you leave the judges out of it. We go to Bruce Buffer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 40 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by TKO.